Welcome to Coffee Italia TV. My name's Grant Paul Adams, and today we're gonna to be showing you how to make espresso-based drinks using the brand new for 2020 Ranchilio Silvia V6. And it's accompanying coffee grinder, the Ranchilio Rocky Grinder. <laughs> So if you've been searching for the perfect espresso machine in order to push your skills from home enthusiast up to home barista, you can't get much better than the Ranchilio Silvia V6. In this particular model, we have several brand new features for 2020 that are really going to give it that extra special edge when you're making coffee at home. First of all, we have a black elegant polycarbonate group head cover. We also have a stainless steel steam wand, which is not only durable, but has plenty of power and is also very, very easy to keep clean. There are brand new icons on each of the switches and you also have for that extra professional touch, a wooden handled 58 millimeter coffee tamper. Setting up the machine couldn't be easier. Once you've found your designated place, you wanna start by filling up the water tank with water. Generally speaking, I'd advise using either bottled water or water that's been filtered through a filtration system. You can also get something like a Brita filter, which will enable you to do this straight from the kitchen. We then wanna make sure that we turn the machine on, which can be done from the very top center button by switching down. Now, this has two lights to it, a green light to show that there's power going to the machine and an amber light to show you that it's warming through. Now, a good tip to ensure that there's enough water filling the system is to actually use the steam wand. Now, what we want to do first and foremost is ensure that there's water going through it. So we're gonna turn on our steam system, put a jug just underneath that steam wand, and we're gonna open up our valve. This will then start pushing water through that system to ensure that nothing is overheating, nothing is overboiling. Perfect. So how about our other switches? Now we know that everything's all working properly, what else can we expect from this? Well, should you wanna start making your espresso, you need to first pop your porter filter with your coffee straight into the group head. Now espresso in Italian does actually mean express. So you are making an express coffee all through pressure. The water is pushed through the coffee in the porter filter itself, and that's how you get that beautiful crema and the dark separation between the main body of your coffee and that lovely thick crema on top. If you then wanna to top up your coffee with water, you need to get some hot water from the system as well. And you can do this by pressing the second button down. And what that will actually allow to do is water to push through that steam wand so you get that running of hot water. Perfect for your Americano or for your long black. Now in order to make the perfect espresso based drink, you're gonna need the perfect coffee grinder. And an amazing accompaniment to the Ranchilio Silvia is the Ranchilio Rocky Grinder. We have our on off switch at the lower left hand side here. To get our ground coffee, we have a small button just at the lower front right hand side. We have this really convenient frame on the front of the machine. Now this means that you can place your porter filter into it and actually get the coffee grinds to go straight into the porter filter rather than causing any messy saves anywhere else. This can also be removed though. Should you actually want to put coffee grounds into something perhaps a little bit bigger, like a V60 or a Chemex, this can be removed and you can place a larger vessel underneath. We then have the benefit of a removable tray from the bottom, so any excess coffee that you do spill can be removed and got rid of with great ease. Now one thing about the Rocky Grinder itself is that it's a step grinder. You have to turn it whilst the machine is actually grinding coffee, otherwise it will just jam it all together. So there is a bit of a trick to this because this doesn't just move by itself. You have a small switch at the very top. As soon as you suppress this down, this will allow you to rotate the top. However, while it's running, there's a little knack to it because you do need several hands to work together. The best way of doing this is to hold down the button on the lower right hand side to grind your coffee. Always easier to remove the lid for this as well. As we're doing that, we can hold down the switch at the front and then we can simply rotate the head of the hopper to give us our brand new grind size. Now the reason that you need to dial in espresso using a grinder like this is to ensure that you get the right extraction. So dialing in will enable you to find the perfect balance between a fine grind and the perfect espresso time to extract. 
Now, generally when you're using this, after you've fine tuned it, you want to ensure that the grounds are fine enough to not cause any problems, but not too fine where it almost feels like talcum powder and it clogs up your machine. It may take several attempts to get this right, but that's not a problem. Once you've got it right, it's gonna work perfectly for those beans. So let's make ourselves a cappuccino and let's see how each of these things come together so that we can make our perfect milk-based drink. <laughs> Cleaning your Ranchilio Silvia couldn't be easier. There are several things to take into consideration when doing this to make your life straightforward. First of all, we can remove the small drip tray at the very top. This will then give you access to a small drip tray just underneath. You can empty this because it pulls out nice and easily and you can give it a wipe over as well. The cup holder goes simply back on top and you're good to go. In order to keep the steam wand nice and clean, what you want to make sure you do is that every time you make a drink, you purge a steam wand by turning it on again. Remember, that means turning it anti-clockwise and then just giving it a brief wipe down afterwards with a cloth. That will ensure that there's no buildup and no excess steam inside the boiler. So if this seems like the perfect espresso maker for your home kitchen, don't forget to order yours now from Cafe Italia. See you soon.